I'm Dick Simmons from the popular web series, Red vs. Blue. And I'm Dexter Griff from the same show. <sighs> kids these days, am I right? Go off, king. Did I, did I do that right? I did, right? Probably not. Lots of people spend their time these days terminally online. And as such, you might find yourself confused by the lingo people use on the World Wide Web. Big mood. Am I right? Stop doing that. Like most anything, language evolves through unique confluences of geography, culture, and circumstance. <laughs> Over time, a shared common language will begin branching into distinct dialects, sometimes becoming an entirely new language altogether. On the internet, this happens every few weeks. It doesn't take very long before you get left behind. And then, how are you going to share that funny tweet you saw with your boss, Joe Business Guy? <laughs> it really do be like that. Now, you might expect this PSA to be some sort of explainer to help bring you up to speed. But by the time we finished it, it would be hilariously out of date. We'd all sound like a couple of boomers doing that. Mm -hmm. People still call them boomers, right? You know, that sounds really, really derogatory the way you say it. Aw, uh, thanks. I've been taking classes. While we can't exactly keep up with the speed of the internet, we can do the next best thing. Predict it. Para el registro, no accepte participar en esto. A big welcome to our science volunteer, Lopez. Using the latest in predictive algorithms, we've pumped Lopez full of, well, the entire internet, in the hopes that he'll be able to tell us the future of internet slang. Era sobre todo porno. He visto literalmente todo el porno. In fact, he's receiving more updates as we speak. Si, sí, mas porno. Ooh. Let's see the first of what we can expect from the next wave of internet lingo. Lopez? Por favor, no hagas lo que ensayaste. Compute! Ugh. And the printout says... Huh. Error. As in error is going to be internet slang in the future? Feels a little retro. Oh, like when someone says something you don't like, maybe? Whoa, man. Error. Do you think you're supposed to sound like a robot when you say it, though? Lopez? Any thoughts? Why are you asking him? I mean, it's kind of obvious, right? Literalmente significa que hubo un error. Porque este plan es estupido. Hmm, you're right, Lopez. Griff did handle that insensitively. Wait, what? All right, let's run it again. Tell us what our next future internet word is, Lopez. Genshi. Huh, what do you suppose that means? Maybe it's something bad, like, whoa, that smells Genshi, dude. No cap! What do you think Genshi smells like? Ah, Genshi! That's a word I haven't heard in some time. Wait, 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 wait. You know what it means? But I thought the algorithm was supposed to predict the future of slang. That would be the Genshiest if it worked. Sounds like an actuality, though. It is decidedly un -Genshi. Can I get somebody to translate that? Sierga vieja idiota. Why, Genshi was a popular phrase in the 50s. Oh, that really takes me back. It's important to know for context that Griff it's clearly not Genshi. Takes you back? Weren't the 1950s, like, centuries ago? Yeah, but these things have a way of circling back around. Every time you think you've got it made in the shade, some new ankle biters get on the horn and shake things up. Bit of a wet rag, Daddy-o, if you catch my drift. So really, to predict the future, we just need to look in the past? Yeah, you'd be surprised. Well, that's dumb. Definitely doesn't rise my berries. Yeah, I didn't catch any of that. Lopez? Uh, error. <laughs> 